Now, you may think the operating theatres at Guy's and St Thomas's are hushed, they are silent, because you've got some of the country's top surgeons plying their trade there. But you know what? You couldn't be more wrong. They can be on their feet for 12 hours at a stretch, often in the middle of the night. So what helps some of our top surgeons concentrate? I think music in theatre creates a very pleasant working environment, not just for me, but for everybody. Every operation has its rhythm. Stitch, stitch, stitch. So I've kind of set up the playlist, so depending on what I'm doing, it has the right rhythm. So exactly what rhythms help calm one of the country's best orthopaedic surgeons? I am an anti -coast. It starts off with the Sex Pistols. I am an -coast. Two o'clock in the morning, I've been called into a difficult case and just got to get on with it, really, and pump up the sort of volume. Don't know what I want, but I know how to get it. Well, I've been here for three years now, and I've got to be honest, when I first arrived, the first year was difficult on the music side. I I think given time, they sort of learn to appreciate everyone's music taste, particularly mine. <laughs> but across the corridor, it's all rather more refined. Well, usually we're listening to, to opera, unlike most of my colleagues. Sometimes just regular classical music, but uh, yeah, opera's the most fun. If, if you've got a CD that lasts for about an hour, that would be the typical length of an operation. So you should just be closing up just, um, just by the closing bars. And as you might expect, there's a healthy creative tension between our punks and our Puccinis. Sometimes get um, requests from next door the theatre, the orth orthopaedic series <laughs> will ask us to turn it down, but we don't like their opera music, so uh, we tend to crank it up a bit. Then. Yeah, we like to uh, drown out the noise of the drills and the hammers. So, is there someone who can broker a music middle ground, a surgical solution to smashy and nicey? I do like ABBA, and I have to say that my favourite uh, song for operating to has to be Dancing Queen. It's certainly got all the right beats. That doesn't mean that I'm a queen. But sadly, two Swedish girls just don't do it for one surgeon. Actually, I find music actually quite disruptive in the operating theatre. I sometimes let them have the radio on, but usually, usually the staff sort of turn it off after a while because I besiege them with uh, trivia questions on the artist and year, uh, or I sing along. So usually after a half an hour, they, they give up. With or without music, they're all stars in the theatre, but maybe some still long for the stage. Don't stop me, don't stop me, don't stop me. Hey, hey, hey. Occasionally play drums. I sing into my mask. Hey, oh, I'm a great air guitar player and a super drummer as well. But until that recording contract arrives, listening to music's just one more way to get the job. Well done. If you enjoy the atmosphere you're working in, then you enjoy being there and you enjoy coming into work every day. Yes, a good time. I don't want to stop at all. All right, okay. let's go. Rock okay. and roll. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs>